Hey yo, hey yo, who we about to put to the test? Welcome back to the channel, it's your boy, Marty Raz. Let's get it, baby. I'm not a people person, I'm just the people's person. The person people go to when they feel undeserving. Burdened by narcissism, but I swear I'm really worth it. Perfect diverted versions of the most perfect versions. Today we got Nova Rockefeller did your best. You know we got to jump on it. I'm a little bit late on it, but you know we got to jump on the video. She did a great job with her last video. I'm excited to see what she does with this video. I follow her and subscribe to her on YouTube, so I know that she said that this is all about her family. So I'm excited to listen and see what she's really talking about and really what she's bringing to the table. If you are not yet subscribed, please smash that subscribe button. We're trying to bring videos every single day. I'm trying to do my best out here, but without further ado, let's just jump right into the video. At school he couldn't do the work, the kids all called him retarded He got a job in a warehouse where he packed and cut carpet And he never moved up, and he never fell in love He's 50 but really 12, thinking about giving up She married young and always felt like she had gotten too deep Started feeling like her only way out was to cheat Her friends all villainized and didn't see she was weak It's been 20 years and it still breaks her heart that they don't speak He was a rock star in small bars until the gates weren't paying bills, he had his daughter in the car And he knew he had to make the choice to put down his guitar And every day he wonders if he could have been a star I think, I think that she's talking about her father there I don't know what the first bar, the first bar might have been about freaking the time I'm not 100% sure It just kind of showed his face so it kind of gave me that feeling But I'm not really 100% sure that maybe the second line was about her mom And then the third line was about her father saying that he was, you know Left his daughter in the car, could have been a rock star, but he gave it all up, you know, to, you know, be with his daughter or whatever it may be. So far, like, great storytelling bars, right? The cadence and everything. is She's doing a really great job. She's telling a story. You can imagine it. I like, I like songs like this. I like artists that can do this. They put a picture inside of your mind. Very, very, very good. She's doing it very well. Oh, you did your best. So she made this song for her family. She's just letting her family know, like, I know that you did your best. You got nothing to prove to me. I know that you did your best. I know that you did everything that you could have done in that situation. And she's like, you know, I love you. I respect you. I appreciate that. I did see that on her story on YouTube where she was talking about, like, she just wanted to tell her family, like, you know, I'm I'm in California and you're you're wherever you are. And that I love you, I appreciate you and everything that you do. And I know that you did your best, man. I like that a lot, man. She's doing that very well. But there's more to you than the wars you lose, you'll see. Diagnosed with Parkinson's, it's something she lives with. We're strong and independent, now we're lies and the children. Her voice shakes when she speaks, she's embarrassed, she hates to talk. And every day she wakes up wondering if new parts of her are lost. He got her pregnant before he could finish school He got busy acting dumb cause he didn't know what to do He ignored he had a girl till her mother stopped calling too On his deathbed he wished for the daughter he never knew She loved her family, two girls and two boys Husband in the garage, she yells she's sick of the noise And the one day he's out riding and he dies in a crash Now she'd do anything to have the buzz of his shock Bro them storytelling bars are just hitting, man. Man, I can see why she was crying, making this, talking about her family. Like, they hit so hard. This is a crazy freaking song to listen to. Like, like if you didn't know her and you listen to this and now you get kind of like a little little de uh, detail of her life and you kind of get a little backstory. Like, it's, man, that's crazy. Everything that she's talking about, like having, you know, her, her grandmother having Parkinson's and stuff like that and like, Man, it's just crazy to think about. Like, it's very, very sad to think about that. But it's also so amazing that she can put this in a song this way, man. Let her fans kind of know kind of her life and, you know, you know what I mean? The Hangover Gang appreciates that. Oh, you did your best. too like i'm just gonna point out you could tell the emotion and like how strongly she feels about this song you can tell everything you know like just screaming and just putting that emotion out there i like that a lot i like that tom sitting next to her during this whole time you know comforting her whatever it may be man i like this song a lot i love storytelling rap and hip-hop like that man i don't know what else to say but there's more to you than the wars you lose you'll see Everybody feel the 
song the storytelling in that song the emotion that she brought you know her cadence was freaking amazing you could listen to that song and like think about your past and what you've gone through in your family and you you know like if you're if you had a single mother like I did or you had a father that was never around or died at a young age you know you could still say like as you grow up you can be like I know that you did your best in those situations you did everything that you had to do and you know you don't got nothing to prove to me like, I know that you did your best. She put that very, very well. I think she did a great job in this song. I love the raw emotion. I love everything that she brought forth and gave us a backstory. It made me respect her a lot. It made me want to listen to more music. And now I got to go listen to more music. So thank you for watching the reaction video. I got to go check out some more music by Nova Rockefeller. If you're not subscribed to the channel, please smash that sugar with a little love. So thank you for watching the reaction video. I got to go listen to some more Nova Rockefeller because this song was freaking fire. If you're not subscribed to the channel yet, please smash that subscribe button and hit the notification bell because we're bringing videos every single week. And as always, I appreciate y'all. I love y'all. And until next time, peace.